Hello to this new video. This video is a follow up on the Cock X videos I did before on this channel. There was a recent update at the GitHub from the Cock X custom nodes add on. The workflows I built in the tutorials are broken now, so you have to replace two nodes and adjust some settings and uh, I will guide you through these changes so that you can use your workflows again. So if you did the workflow and um, opened it after the custom nodes got updated, you are welcoming by this. These two red nodes changed and you have to replace them. Let's quickly do it. This is the old sampler. We need the new sampler. And let's reconnect all the noodles, the model, the positive prompt, the negative prompt. Then we can connect the VAE directly from the video model loader to the decode. And we need to replace this node. Let's replace it with the new encode node. Double click on the background, image encode. We can connect the image to the start image and we need the VAE. And we can then fill the samples into our image condition latency port of our sampler. Let's connect the samples to the decode samples. And let's have a look, that should be it. Let's delete this one. Let's delete this one. And now, since the download cock video GGUF model loader has changed a bit, the attention mode setting is changed. So we need to set this to STPA or S-A-G-E-A-T-T-N. I choose the first one and then we should be good to go. Let's have a quick test. So the post generation worked quite fine. Sampler seems to generate. The GPU fans are starting to blow. Things seem to work. Some people were not so happy with the results of the dancing bear. It looks really like a human being and not like a bear. I'm not happy with this either, but I'm still working on a better prompt to solve this and to get a bear which looks more like a bear. The other tests I did with Cock Video were quite promising and the results were quite nice. These dancing animals are not as great as I would like. So the reason is we are generating the pose from this girl and this is a human pose and a human uh, movement. So that might be the problem. As far as I find a better way and a better, uh, a better prompt to get better results, I'll let you know. We see the result here. Everything is working again. So I hope that video helped you. I will link everything in the description below. You can download the updated workflows on my Patreon with a base membership, as well as many other workflows. I hope this video helped you to get things running again. And I hope to see you soon. Goodbye.